welcome it's Corinne thank you so much for joining me today if this is your first time um, watching one of my videos on my channel um, please consider subscribing uh, I am a big Neville Goddard fan I've been studying his work for the last two years so on my channel I share my personal experience about experiences about like you know how i use his work to manifest things in my life deliberately and then a lot of times i will literally just read through his books because i find it to be so profound so if that's something that you're interested in hearing more about subscribe don't forget to hit the bell notification so you know when new videos comes out come out and um, let's dive into this so in this video i wanted to do what i call a little flashback i think for myself, all the time, I'm always worried about my next accomplishment. What else can I do? What's on my list? What do I want to get done? And I think we all need to just settle down for a little bit and give ourselves credit for where we have been. Um, if you look around in your world, in your life, oftentimes you will find things that are there that didn't used to be there. And I was thinking the other day about my home. I have a beautiful house, but I've been looking at some other houses. And so I want to get a new house um, in the next year, maybe 18 months or so. But I had to remind myself of where I am in relationship to where I've been. So leave me a comment below, okay, that tells me or anyone else that's watching this video of something that you have accomplished that was once a goal of yours. My house that I live in now is beautiful. I got a letter from a realtor the other day because you know the market is really hot right now. And I'm like, I'm not selling my home. When I get my new house, I'm gonna rent this house out. But then I reflected back to before I brought my home I was trying to manifest it. I was trying to rebuild my credit. I was trying to build my income and all of these things that I felt that I needed to do in order to buy my house. And I accomplished them. And so we need to give thanks and express gratitude that where we are now is in most cases, a place of where we want it to be. Where I am right now is a current manifestation of what I want it to do. So I wanted to just hop on and do a quick video of really just reflecting back as, you know, where were you? You know, whether you were looking for a new job and now you have one, whether you are living in a great house and you want a new one, but like, let's just be thankful that you already accomplished this wonderful home that you have now and i feel that oftentimes when i do a little flashback and reflect on where i am now in comparison to where i used to be i get this little wave of gratitude and appreciation that really just warms my heart and open things up and so don't forget to count your blessings. Maybe that's what I'll title this video. Don't forget to count your blessings. Don't forget to give yourself a high five for where you currently are because you know what? We're all kicking ass out here, all right? We're all improving the quality of our lives. We're reading through some spiritual teachings that educate us on the power within and we're applying that. It doesn't happen overnight and um, Although some things can happen overnight, but there are things that don't happen overnight. You know, they need a time and a period to grow and develop. So don't forget to give yourself credit. You're doing an awesome job. Reflect back on where you were three years ago, five years ago, one year ago, six months ago, and give yourself credit for that, okay? So thank you for tuning in. Um, my next video is going to have a little bit more insight on our inner conversations so watch out for that uh please don't forget to leave a comment below and let me and the other folks know hey this is something that i wanted to accomplish and i am where i want to be even though i am still growing so it's important for us to give ourselves credit for what we've already done and um acknowledge that of course we're still expanding and growing because that's the way life is thank you guys bye